doing what it can to make one disease a thing of the past, a memory. News 18's Kiara Lake reports on how they plan to help cure Alzheimer's. This was one that just blew my mind. You know, if you pick up a tube of toothpaste and the toothbrush would be sitting right there, and she wouldn't be able to connect that, you know, you need your toothbrush and the toothpaste to brush your teeth. Tyler Duby says his mother, Karen, was diagnosed with early onset Alzheimer's in 2011. She was 48 years old. That's extremely young. Um, and so I know for me personally, I went through a lot of doubting. You kind of doubt the medical profession, like surely they miss something. He says Alzheimer's is the sixth leading cause of death in the United States, and it's the only disease in the top 10 that doesn't have a prevention. It doesn't have a treatment, that doesn't have a cure, um, and we, we want to change that, and we want to change that as soon as possible. Tyler says his brother Landon and father Lanch tried to schedule a golf outing to raise money. The event never happened because they could not get donations or sponsors. Even though people want to help you, they also want tax breaks as well. This was a learning experience for them. We knew that we could make a bigger impact um, on finding a cure, on taking care of other families that are in similar situations to ours, and uh, this was the year that we decided to, to do it. On April 4th, the KLD Foundation was created by the family in Lafayette as a nonprofit domestic corporation. It's named after Tyler's mother, Karen Lee Duby. They recently had their first event, A Night to Remember. When it's something that you care about, you're always surprised when you get the support from the community. More than 200 people came and $20,000 was raised. Tyler says the Alzheimer's Association projects they are close to finding a cure. So that means sometime in our lifetime, somebody will be cured of this disease. And we'd rather make that sooner rather than later. The foundation is the family's tool to promote Alzheimer's research. Each year, the goal is to keep growing and keep improving and getting one step closer to finding a cure. Um, and we're going to do whatever we can to raise as much money as we can, as quickly as we can. The KLD Foundation made its first $10,000 donation Monday to Joyful Journey. Reporting in Lafayette, Kiera Lake, News 18.